Welcome to the Anko Show. I'm here with a legend, high life legend. I mean, he has done it all when it comes to music, when it comes to the high life genre. You think I've done it all? Uh, You've done it all. You've done it all. <laughs> the gods of the high life music, especially contemporary high life. I'm here with none other. He doesn't need introduction, but still I'm going to mention his name. Kwabina Kwabina. Yes. Uh, about you, you, you talk about love. You preach about love. Yeah. In fact, you most people say you have become a symbol of love. Yeah. But you represent love. Yeah, I do represent love, but I mean, it looks like I, I never got lucky. Wow. <laughs> looks like you never got lucky. The the thing you you sang about. Yeah. As, um, but I but mean, I I still I still believe in love. I still powerful. do. That's I still powerful. do because I I see that. Um, Maybe it's my test. Yeah, I see it like it's a test. I, like, I don't know. It's a test. Maybe it's a test I need to pass. So um, things keep happening so that uh, it will look like um, maybe I failed at it. Okay. But I don't think I did. I just have not met the right person. Yeah, I don't. I, I feel I've not met the right person who truly deserves me. At this at this stage, you've still yeah. not met the right person. Yeah, I've not. I have not because I I can say I can I can hit my chest and say that anybody who has been with me before misses me till today. Till wow. today. Till today. Yeah, I am so confident about that. I'm very confident because I know what I bring to the every table. single lady. Every single lady. I know what I bring to the table. Every single lady who have been around me before fucking misses me till today. I mean, has has, mm-hmm. has some of them tried to <laughs> because I mean, yeah, 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 I, I, yeah. You have to swallow your pride sometimes. Not you, but the ladies that have have, have been with have you. Sometimes you have to just swallow their pride and try and see if they can. <laughs> <laughs> so I need to tell you something, yeah. Okay. To tell you something, about ninety percent of the ladies I've been with, they actually sorted after me. About ninety percent. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I'm serious. So, and yeah. was that as, as and they, a result? And, and I don't know. They come in and they go on their own. <laughs> so, so, <laughs> so they suck after you. <laughs> after they had, they have a chance to be with you. They yeah, still and go then, up. and then they mess up, and then they go up, <laughs> and then they miss me, <laughs> and then they still want to come back. Ah. But it's too late. Do you, so do you close the door on them? What it is is I give you so much opportunity to be able to be yourself and to be able to. And like be the best of yourself. Okay, so. I am. I, I I I hardly judge. I mean, I am not that person. I don't judge people. I am not that person. So, like, I feel that I give you every room. Mm-hmm. So when you exhaust every room and you burn every every bridge, <laughs> you leave yourself. <laughs> you burn the bridges. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so that's how it is. It's, I mean, it's saying most, at their end, not most, your end. Yeah, yeah, not at my end because it's most of the times, most of the times, they burn the bridges at their end. Okay. And it makes it difficult for them to come back to you. If you talk to, talk to you. you know, I so. so, would you say all these stories contributed to the birth of Famisa? The yeah. album itself? Yeah, yeah, all these stories, all these stories actually experiences. Uh, experience, exactly, I actually yeah. came together to actually write from Sahara because I look at myself and I'm like, come on man, I'm such a wonderful person. Yeah. 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 Let me see how I mean let me let me see. Blow your trumpet. Let me blow my own trumpet, man. Like I'm I'm such a great person, like you know, I'm that person who I mean even my mama actually talks about, hey, I mean, any woman who actually gets you as a man is a very lucky woman. Come on, my mama can say that about me. Wow. And yo, man, any ladies try to mess with me, I ain't gonna do that yet. Wow. Nah. Wow. I'm gonna I'm gonna be there and I'm gonna give that lady who deserves me that opportunity. Right. I won't settle for less. And I won't settle for anything that that doesn't, doesn't fit me. Fit you. No, I won't settle for that. So if it's not going to make you happy, you're out. I will I'm out like mm. <laughs> but this, 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 this particular album, yeah. as I said, there's, there's in Sembe Brio album, yeah. like, there's a lot of stories. Each song has a story, a unique story back in it. Yeah. And it, it has to do with love again. Yeah, everything is love because 
love will always be the message and the message is love and because, that's where you start to love yeah because guess what Sunny? we must we must preach love we must preach love because it looks like lately all we're preaching is money mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and it's dangerous it is dangerous for our society wow. because if we don't preach love and people don't choose love over anything then gradually that's why you saw a 16 year old trying to kill a 10 year old for money that was that was heartbreaking that's that, right. that was that was that was that's so, right. so, because, so heartbreaking because if people are now in relationship now people are choosing money over love it's the same as the 16 year old killing a 10 year old for money for money yeah because if you wake up in the morning and your girlfriend come and tell you that she wants money if you don't give her money she's going she's, out, going, she's going to sleep with another person is that not killing that's killing thank that's, you that's emotional torture thank you very much it's true so what's the difference so we, 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 this generation is not setting an example. That this generation there. is is sick. Wow. Especially the females, they are sick. Wow. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where they are looking for money. What they are going to do with money? Sika <laughs> emoja. Yeah, but I mean, at, at the end of the day, yes, of all your bad, very many Yes. Yeah. Do you understand what I'm saying? And you have to humble yourself under a man's roof for him to take care of you. But right now they are all saying they are feminists Feminine. and they want to behave in a certain manner, yet they are sleeping with men for money. Wow. So it's neither like here nor there. The standard is. Yeah, is okay, you're a feminist. Why would you do things as a feminist? You want to go and try to say, yeah, build your career, let us see you building yourself. The feminists, if you see them in a, in a certain way, it's neither like here nor there. So you, you, you support strong, independent women? Yes, I do. Why not? An independent person. Yes, and matter of fact, matter of fact, mm-hmm. you must be very independent to be able to talk about love. Seriously. That's what wow. I realized. Wow. Yeah, a dependent woman cannot talk about love because she can be compromised. A wow. woman that can be compromised cannot be talking about love. About love. No, she's lying. I tried it. Because no. love. No, 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 no. They can be bought. You've tried it. You've been you've been to that. I think that what it is is I really really want to let people understand that love is not negotiable. Okay. Love has nothing to do with money. Love has nothing to do with money. Let's get it right. Okay? Everybody will make money. Mm-hmm. Nobody's a lazy person. You yeah, see, yeah. we flaw it like as if even the Bible says he only only when saying you human did it. So everybody is working whichever way ends we meet. You understand? Yeah, yeah. So we should not equate love to money. Money. When we do that, we we've destroyed we, the we, we destroy the whole thing. Do you understand? What I'm yeah. saying? Sammy, how would you feel if yeah. you know for a fact that this woman who is with me is, is with me because of something? I mean, that, was, that would be sad. You can have all the money in the world, no, but you no, cannot no. be happy being with somebody, somebody because you know that she's with you because you, you bought her a car, okay. she's with you because you bought her a phone. Any man who is actually happy because that girl is sleeping with you because you bought her a phone, you must be a fool. Wow. wow. I mean, I mean, I don't know what you're enjoying. It should be unconditional. There you go. Like, I don't know, like, I, I, I don't know how I will feel if I know that, oh, that girl is, is messing with me because, because I'm the position oh, I am. Oh, fuck that shit. I mean, you, you, you have it's represent, you, you've represented it's love. Flawed. You've spoken about love over the years. And from what you're saying, do you believe this generation still believe in love? I beg to differ. Because of the social media presence, because of all these things people want to do to impress each other and to even uh, they want to do to impress people they don't even know no and people who don't even people who don't even love them for likes and comments for and likes and comments from people they don't even know and they will never meet ha <sighs> that's quite a generation <laughs> <laughs> this generation is in trouble <laughs> <laughs> i don't know what they're in love with this generation is in yeah, trouble. they're in love with the social media likes and they're in love with the people on social the media. Social media. And not, yeah. I mean, we, we don't value the real essence of love. Yeah, because, listen, 
trust me, I, I don't know but Something happened and I realized the power of social media. Wow. I have been friends with somebody for, for years. And I realized the person that actually was actually um, talking behind my back to somebody that person met on social media quite recently. The person is trading true friendship yeah. to social media. To social media friend. Can you understand? That's, that's, I'm that's, talking about somebody I've known for like eight, nine years. And, and that person yeah. is trading that friendship for, for somebody. For, he was on social, on social media. That's Just, when I realized the generation is fucked up. We don't value, we don't you don't value, value nothing. nothing. Y'all don't value nothing. Wow. Wow. Man. Social media. I mean, so. <laughs> <laughs> because everything that I've experienced should, 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 should make me hate women. Hmm. Honestly. Wow. Yeah. From the hands of women. Yeah, from the hands of women. When you you you, you come with open hearts, yeah, you, you you are welcome with the opposite hands. Every moment, I've experienced some very 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 brutal, dark-minded dark human beings. I think when 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 legends like you that talk about love all the time, yeah, experience the dark side of love. I mean, sometimes it, it, it's mine, you, you, you find it very hard to, to understand because you preach about love. So, I mean, the ordinary Ghanaian like me or the ordinary music lover like me will say, okay, then you'll get the best form of love. I tell you something, it's understandable that if you have, if you have something which attracts, which attracts people, it's understandable that you attract all kinds of people. Okay. And uh, it's understandable that you have attract somebody who is very cunning and deceitful. This, this is, it's very, very likely. You have faced that. Yeah, 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 it's very, very like like I don't really beat myself so much. It's just that I pity them for them trying to, to do that be deceitful too. around me and trying to. I mean, I, I, I get, find. I, get, I mean, I get, it's your own problem, though. Yeah, yeah. But then, but you suffer the consequences sometimes. But come on, I'm that person who is like who looks like hey. I can take advantage of him. I am that person. Wow. Yeah. I am that person. And every single person says it in my face. You are that person, you are vulnerable, you are that, you are that, you are that. At the end of the day, they also take advantage of me. So why 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 is it that okay, so if they tell you, why don't you just stay away? No, what it is is in this life, right? Yeah. That's why I said Fabisa. I mean, what's the story behind Quadidi? Because <laughs> Quadidi is, is like a smooth ride. Yeah, Quadidi like, uh, is like um, that song you want to play when you're going to see your girl. Oh! Yeah. Wow, wow, yeah. wow, wow, wow. It's like that song, that moment. I walk out Quadidi. Okay. But you see. I just say, so it's I say. Like, And uh, the way it's so beautiful, you miss it. You understand? It's, it's, it's a bear, quite quite I know, I know. Because the song is so smooth. Yeah, yeah. It's, so, it, it, it's a way <laughs> groovy kind of yeah, song, but so, very smooth as well. That's right. And I mean, yeah, that, that vibe. So, quite a day is like, yeah, I mean, love is right song. Yeah. When, yeah. When, when you pick your girl and then challenge she's, she's on, you're, you're going on a, on, on a smooth journey, on a smooth, smooth ride. <laughs> challenge, quite a day. day. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, baby. <laughs> Room money be ever back. Be ever because it is me. <laughs> because of your 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 your, your stage. Yeah. You you are a celebrity. You are a famous yeah. person. You sing about love. Yeah. And everything that talks about love. Yeah. Comes it's, with problems. Comes with problems. And guess what? I know sir. I just me put my young quad here. It comes with problems. With problems. Exactly. So. And my sister did only from the days of the Garden of Eden. <laughs> so. 